There has not been a major terrorist attack in the U.S. since 9-11. Osama bin Laden is dead. The Islamic State's caliphate lies in rubble. So what's the problem here? Uh, why should policymakers be talking about preventing extremism now? And why would you, with all the things you could do, why would you then pick up the co-chairmanship of this task force? Well, Ewan, when, when we did, our commissioners did the 9-11 report, we basically talked about three things that needed to be done. One was obviously they had a sanctuary in Afghanistan, reach those people who did it, and destroy them. That was number one. Secondly, we didn't want this to ever happen again or anything like it. So the second recommendation really was to harden our defenses to create Dan Coates and people of that stature to really coordinate our intelligence operation and make sure that we had the best defenses in the world as from a terrorist attack. And the third thing we said was when we've got to do some preventive measures to get at the ideology itself so we don't create more terrorists. Well, the first two we did, and we've done pretty successfully. The last, not so much. Uh, so this is really, in a sense, a continuation of the 9-11 work, is to, to look and see where terrorists come from, where they breed, which is in failed states or fragile states, and see if we can do something about the breeding ground. What we said in our London report, we would not have had an attack if those terrorists hadn't been allowed to organize and be left alone for three years in Afghanistan to plot and to plan. If they hadn't been able to do that, they couldn't have pulled it off. We said don't ever allow that kind of place to exist again. Uh, we have to disrupt it. So this is, this is an effort and a continuation of our work. Sooner or later, these people, as they continue to spread, and there are 10 times more terrorist attacks last year than there were after 9-11. After um, find, find a way to prevent terrorism. And the way to prevent terrorism is to work in these failed states or fragile states and make sure they're strong enough to prevent terrorism in those states themselves.